Hi, welcome guys. Welcome to Tiske Kalo. Thank you for staying tuned. Thank you for watching all the time, ladies and gentlemen. Nyabonga guys for your support all the time, you know. It's nice to see what you that is cutting in some video I release, you know. I give you the updates, I do the research and you guys, you know, you support the channel you watch. Thank you so much. If you are new also, thank you so much. Please don't forget to click that red button. Subscribe to the channel. I'll keep you updated, you know, daily with Mzanzi Sport News, you know, football news in particular. Today we are speaking about Ulebuhang Manyama. Guys, I'm sure we all remember this uh, phenomenal player uh, attacking midfield. You know, we know him mostly even in Cape Town City, you know. Remember 2016-2017, our footballer of the season ladies and gentlemen you know he used to do very well uh, up until obviously you know things didn't go well for him he got an injury he was released in june you know uh, by ikeza chiefs while carrying a knee injury you know and yeah guys you know things haven't been good for him this season but there's a ton of events and this is why i'm making this video it is because there is a big possibility of seeing him on our screens very soon, you know. Yeah, he looks set to return to action next year as he makes a slow return from this long-term injury that he had, you know. Yeah, he is still training with Cape Town City and Cape Town City is hoping to sign him once he is fully recovered, you know, from his injury. You know, yeah, and the citizens uh, expect the 32 year old to be ready for competitive football early next year. That means, must be guys next year, you know, yeah. We hope with Zobekon, Zobebuile, you know, we know what he is still, he still quality, he is quality. You know, Bejala Amnandi, which used Bejala Amnandi, Cape Town City. So, we'd really love to see him back coming to play, you know. Yeah, truly speaking, we miss seeing him on the pitch, you know, yeah. So, guys, yeah, this is what I wanted to give you today. Some great news indeed. We wish him, you know, a speedy recovery and you know to keep the brand going south african football must progress thank you guys for watching the video